The Star Wars segment has arrived for the Hot Wheels Pop Culture line. Six different models are in the batch. I have all six of them for you today. We're going to open them up and take a look at them. Here we have Luke. By the way, Luke, not Luke and Laura, Luke and uh, Princess Leia, their graphics on the package are the same graphic that's in on the car, on the model. They're the two that kind of got the short end of the stick as far as the graphics department uh, for the character, but overall, all of the models look very good. Uh, another thing is that the Volkswagen drag truck right here, only two per case, as well as the Holland gas, only two per case for these two castings. So they might be a little bit harder for you to find. Nice card art for all of the vehicles, even though I mentioned that uh, Leah and Luke get the same character stance that they do on the model. C3PO, Holland gas in that model there. Quick delivery is for R2-D2. He gets his own decos as well. Now, as far as Darth Vader, he gets the spoiler sport. Nice red line tires for those of you who like a chrome red line tires. And the sixth one, none other than Han Solo, Han Solo. He gets the 1985 Chevy Astro van. Very nice. Let's open them up. I don't buy every single release for the pop culture line, but I generally like to pick up specific models. But for the Star Wars, oh yeah, I'm a fan of Star Wars, so I picked up all six. They're going to be available at any store that sells the pop culture line. This spoiler sport right here, this is an old time Hot Wheels casting. Been around since probably the 80s. Didn't have, it didn't have rubber tires back then, but it's been around for a long time. And then Mattel brought it back from the, for the Hot Ones line a few years ago. Now for the quick delivery, I only have a few samples of this model here. I have the Skittles. I'll give you a link to my video for the Skittles. I bought the whole set because that was a fantastic set. Uh, peanuts, I bought just the Peanuts version because it was like a Halloween. It was orange and it had special tires. So I did buy the Peanuts version. Uh, sorry, I don't have that uh, in any videos to show you. So this is about the third quick delivery model that I have in my collection. The Holland Gas, kind of like a big Twinkie. <laughs> But I do have this from the Hershey's. Big piece of metal, big area for a billboard. Just like, uh, actually all of these models are actually good for billboard space to put graphics. Uh, you know, sometimes in the pop culture they use like an El Camino or something like that. Not a whole lot of room on that one for decos. So I'm glad this one got all the big castings so that they could put a whole bunch of nice graphics on the models that can use the extra area for special designs. Now with uh, Princess Leia, like I said, she was on the dream van. See, look what they did on the top. Just nice, simple design. Spoilers for it. I mean, uh, dream van. This is the dream van XKG. I'm sorry, XGW. Uh, it's an old casting again from the 80s, just like Spoiler Sport. I did a comparison video showing how Hot Wheels had uh, did a casting change with this. But I still like to collect. I haven't collected all the pop culture versions. But this one, I'll pick it up with the set. I like that very much. Now this one's been around for a few years. Volkswagen drag truck. I think it's been around for about 10 years now. I got the Grateful Dead version. Uh, I have a lot more than that. This is definitely one where I try to get every version. Got some taillight tampos there on top. Gave it a little bit of a color. And I don't know if it still does, but this used to open. Yeah, there you go. I don't know if this is, let me take a peek. This might be the only one with opening features. I take that back. I don't know about this model right here. This is, I have a couple of these. I have not bought them. I mean, I have not opened them up. I, I got this 1985 Chevy Astro van in the Mike and Ike series. So I have that blue one. I don't remember if I got the Boulevard version. It was a black and red. But I haven't opened it up. I don't know if it's a funny car or not. I don't know. It's got a rivet in the back. No rivet in the front. I wasn't sure if it was a funny car popping. Nope. Nothing opens up. But this is another one to our just simple graphic on top. Kind It goes, there's uh, actually uh, ridges on top. So it's really nice that they 
have the graphics go along with some of the details of the model. Same with this one right here. There's ridges on top. They have the stripes going right along the ridges, so that, that gives it a nice touch instead of them just kind of slopping something on there. Six nice models in this batch. Like I said, I don't pick up every one, but this one definitely had a couple castings that I love, a few castings that I love, and not only that, uh, kind of like the Star Wars, you know. As far as the other videos that I mentioned, you can click on any of these to jump to one of those. Check the description or click on the info card that popped up and that'll take you to my collectibles playlist and you can find those reviews in that collectibles playlist. Thanks for watching. Happy collecting. Bye bye.